County detectives are searching tonight for three men that want to ask the trio some questions about an assault where a man was beaten, slapped, and kicked even after he passed out. Marina Silva is covering this investigation and joins us with details tonight on this case. Marina? Well, Steve and Lisa, two men have already been charged in this case, and they're here in the Camden County Jail. But detectives here at the Camden County Sheriff's Office are searching for these three men to question them. We're trying to locate, we're trying to find them so that we can talk to them and ask them what their involvement was. Detectives say these are the three men they want to question. 22-year-old John Brennan Richardson from Springfield. 22-year-old Jonathan Cosme Ortiz Gopar from Montreal. And this man, who may go by the name Roberto. Uh, there was uh, upwards of nine people involved in the attack on this victim. And uh, again, we've identified several of them and we are actively looking for them. And then we have the folks that we want to question to determine what did they see kind of leading up to. Aaron Gonzalez and Ramiro Aguilar Garcia are both charged in the assault. Detectives say it happened at a house in Greenview on August 7th. Court documents say the two admitted to police they followed the man from a restaurant that night to the house, more than 11 miles away. We don't know the motivation behind the attack. That's part of why we need to talk to these folks and determine what happened. Police say the man who was beaten had cuts on the back of his head, his eyes were swollen shut, dried blood around his nose and lip, and an imprint of a shoe on the left side of his face. The victim was injured uh, to the point where the, the assault charges coming down on the two that we have currently in custody, those are first degree assault charges. So that's, that's a very serious assault. Aguilar Garcia is scheduled to be in court tomorrow, Gonzalez later this month. Now the case notes say because of the safety of others, they were denied bond. As for the man who was beaten, detectives will not release his name, but they do say he is out of the hospital tonight and recovering. If you have any information on these three men who are wanted for questioning, you're asked to contact Detective Nelson here at the Camden County Sheriff's Office and his number is at the bottom of your screen. If you did not catch that, we will have have it on this story in KY3.com. Reporting live in Camden County, I'm Marina Silva, KY3 News.